prophecy says that the Seeker will defeat Dark and Rob. Thanks to the Seeker, that monster is dead. I'm not in for all eternity in the underworld. Kneel before the Keeper. Leave me, Boston. I have failed you. No, you have succeeded exactly as I intended. It's a tear in the veil that separates the underworld from the world of the living. Sabin will have killed Rob. As long as it's open, there's no way to prevent the Keeper of the underworld from sending his minions to bring death to every living thing. The only way to close the rift is the way the Creator sealed the underworld. The Stone of Tears. You'll find it. Seek out the abbot of Ulrich, for he keeps the secret of the stone close to his heart. She's the one who helped me kill Dark and Rob. Whatever she did, she did it to save her own skin. If you're foolish enough to turn down the throne of Tahara, then you need me all the more. If this is some sort of trick, I will kill you. It's the mark of the Keeper, the one who would destroy all life. Richard Cypher, you are the true seeker. Thanks for letting me borrow this, although I can't say it helped me sleep more soundly. It's going to take a while to get used to having more Sith in camp. Well, if Richard trusts Kara, I suppose we'll have to learn to as well. Does it hurt? It's nothing. The spirit of the tyrant you killed comes back from the grave and burns the mark of the keeper in your chest? It's not nothing, Richard. I wish I knew what it meant. What we do know is that we need to seal a rift between this world and the underworld. And to do that, we need to find the Stone of Tears. To find the stone... We need to get to the Abbot of Ulrich. It must have burned at least three months ago. These weeds are at least that old. Harms did this. Then where are the corpses? If the Abbot isn't here, then we've come a long way for nothing. If the Harns did this, and they didn't kill the monks, where would they have taken them? From here, they would have been taken to Tothrain. What's Tothrain? The death camp. The faster you get this loaded, the faster you'll get your reward. General, why are we still executing prisoners? The war is over. We should be getting far away from this place. You've heard the reports of reprisals against the Harans. The best way to ensure there are no reprisals for what's been done here is to make certain that no one lives to tell the tale. Don't worry, Commander. We'll take this treasure and we'll be far away from here by the time anyone comes looking for retribution. Just as soon as we finish the task at hand. your reward. All right, I'll do you a favor. I'll leave it loose. You'll take longer to die.
you seek. We're looking for the abbot of Ulrich. We believe he's brought here. I'm sorry. I don't know anything about the abbot. But there are children here we have to free. The Daharans didn't just come for resistance fighters. They took our families, too. Where are they? Come, I'll show you. It's all right. You're safe. I need to find my son. What's his name? William? I'm Eleanor. Don't worry. I'll help you find him. brought here. Where is he? General had him executed yesterday. I tried to stop the executions. You didn't try hard enough. We all lived in fear of the general. There's a reason that we called him the butcher. We hadn't followed his orders. We'll be now next in nooses. It may still be. But that's for the mother confessor to decide. Lock them in the cells. We came here for the abbot. He's dead. There's no reason for us to stay. Look at these people. They're sick. They're scared. They have no place to go. We can't just leave them here. There's already enough sickness in this place. Let's bury these bodies before it gets any worse. to travel are free to leave, but those of you that aren't will be making a camp just outside the prison. If these prisoners are going to gain their strength back, we're going to have to feed them something more substantial than to harm gruel. Should we draw them one bath as well? Do you know of anyone heading in the direction of Deer Fork? The Dragon Corps wiped out Deer Fork months ago. But that's my father's village. We'll try to find out where the survivors have relocated. Deer Fork was a resistant stronghold. No one would have been left alive. But my father wasn't a resistance fighter. He was just a locksmith. That would have made no difference to the Dragon Corps. Where will we go? The rest of my family died here. I am so sorry for your loss. But you need to be strong for your son. We'll see what we can find out about your father. Shouldn't give her folks hope. It wasn't so long ago that you served the one that caused all this misery. At least try to show some compassion. Come with me.
I checked the storerooms. There's barely enough to feed the rats. How can there be this many people with no food? When the war ended, the supply shipment stopped. What food there was went to the guards. The Harns would as soon put a knife in our bellies than a hot meal. I'm sending Kara to get provisions. Hopefully there'll be enough food for everyone. No. Everyone? We'd have more to eat if we didn't have so many mouths to feed. The Jaharans will be brought to justice, but we're not going to starve them to get it. Yes, Mother Confessor. I need a horse. I have to bury my brother. We need the horses to get provisions. We can bury him outside with the others. I'm not burying my brother alongside the Daharans and killed him. He should be laid to rest beside our mother and father. We're going to need fresh water. My village is half a day's ride. I'll have the horse back to you by morning. Check on the sister. Do it quickly. I'm so sorry for your loss. you're looking for Abbot Henry? I was a member of his order. We need to confide in you a great secret. There's been a tear in the veil between this world and the underworld. The Keeper is waging war in the land of the living. He's using the rift to send horrible creatures into our world. And the only way to close this rift is for us to find the Stone of Tears. We were told that Abbot Henry had knowledge of the secret location of the stone. The abbots of our order always wore a locket. It has a rose inscribed on its face, and it was passed down from abbot to abbot. Shua said the abbot would keep the secret close to his heart. The Daharans took the locket when they brought us to this awful place. We lived in peace until the Daharans came. Seize the abbot! What is this? What is the meaning of this? You have no authority here! No need for this. Our men of peace. No! No! Please! Please! That's sacred! Anything taken from the abbot would have been kept with the valuables we took from the other prisoners. It was the butcher's plan to escape with the treasure. To disappear. And use it to make new lives for himself and his men. Well, now the treasure could help give the prisoners their lives back. Open it. was asking for a horse so he could take his brother to be buried. Apparently he took the treasure instead. And you believed his story? The confessor told me I had to show more compassion. Are you saying this is my fault? Yes. It doesn't matter whose fault it is. We need to find him. Sure. 
He's come back from the grave. Quickly, everyone get inside. This way. Is it true what they're saying? That the butcher killed those people? I don't know. But you'll be safe inside the prison. We need to set up a guard through the night, make sure no one gets in or out. I can take first watch. Keep the doors locked. Keep everyone inside. That won't stop him. I got to see what the butcher was capable of when he killed my friends. If he has come back to take his revenge, he won't stop until he's killed us all. Whoever he is, we'll keep them out. Just in case. everywhere. There's no sign of whoever murdered these men. Is it possible the rumors are true? The butchers come back from the grave. Like Dark and Rawl did. Dark and Rawl was just a spirit. Spirits don't have bodies. They can't pick up knives and slaughter people. We're going to find who did. In the meantime, I need you to find the man who stole the abbot's locket. He can't have gotten far. I don't want him tortured or killed. Bring him back alive. I'll do my best. This butcher's escaped from the grave. I'd like to see it for myself. Someone dug him up. No. He clawed his way out. to the Daharans we bury. Could this be the work of the Keeper? Duck and roll. It's possible. Who else could bring the dead back to life? The Lord Sith. Kara's with us now. Why would she come all this way to resurrect some Daharans with the breath of life? She served Rao and fought side by side with the Daharns for years. Kara helped me defeat Rao. That should earn her some trust. Whoever did this, however it happened, we have a big problem. How do you kill something that's already dead? We have to find them first. Who are you? I am Abbot Henry. The Daharans told us that you had been hung. After the Daharans executed me, I awoke in the underworld. In the pit of unimaginable suffering. I was greeted by Dark and Rowell himself. Well, told me that the Keeper wished to make me an offer. He would allow me to return to the land of the living. But he demanded an awful price. In exchange for letting me live again, I had to agree to kill for the Keeper. He made you a bailiff. Bailings are dead souls who selfishly bargain for a second life in exchange for killing others. I thought they were just a legend. So did I. But it seems the Keeper is using the terror in the veil to give the dead a chance to return to the world of the living. I guess the Butcher and his men accepted his offer. So, can anyone who die become a Bailing? Maybe not. Maybe only in places like Tathrain. The veil between our world and the underworld is weakest in places of great death. The rift is growing. If we don't close it soon, the Keeper could send Banelings back anywhere. We need to 
to find the stone of tears to close the rift in the veil. Brother Bertrand told us that the secret of the stone was inside your locket. Yes. That's why I had to take the keeper's offer. To reclaim the locket and ensure the stone's location wasn't lost forever. Oh, we're trying to find the locket right now. Ah! What's wrong? <sighs> my end of the keeper's bargain. We haven't killed anyone yet. I'm being called back to the underworld. Tell us what we need to do with the locket. I spent years learning the rituals I would need to pass on to you. There's simply not enough time. We have to buy you time. How? You have to kill someone. I'm not sure I can do this. You'll be killing a Dahar and guilty of horrible crimes. It may be the only way to defeat the Keeper. someone else for him to kill. There's no time. You must listen to me. The locket contains a rune scribe. The magic imprints a rune onto the palm of the one who opens it. You must take the rune to the province of Pomora. The rune is the key that will open... Plenty to go around. Sorry to interrupt. I know you're mourning the loss of your brother. We all grieve in our own way. Where's the treasure? I'm not afraid of you. Do you know what horrible things they did to me at Tothrain? Intimately. I didn't break when they put me on the rack. Or when they threw me in the drowning pool. Or when they spun me on the wheel of pain. Torture me all you want. You'll be wasting your time. Oh, I don't want to torture you. I have other ways of loosening your tongue. After the awful way they treated you in that place. I can see why you would hire those women to bring you some comfort. But I'll do things to you those women can't even imagine. Many know of a more this ability to bring pain. But few know we are equally skilled at bringing pleasure. First, I'm going to... Three leagues outside town at the fork in the river. You're dressed. But 
I told you where the treasure was. Take me to it. Now. What about that thing you were going to do? And that other thing sounded good, too. All right, all right, just the first thing, then. The rune is the key, but a key to what? We have no idea what to do with it once we get it there. We have a bigger problem. The butcher and his men are out there somewhere, and they need to kill. Who killed these men? The butcher wouldn't bother with a locked cell when there's much easier prey within these walls. Who else would want them dead? I'm sure any prisoner would want revenge against the Daharans. But only one of them had keys to the cells. Who? A prisoner. A resistance fighter. Find him. What's stopping these dead Daharans from taking the Keeper's deal and becoming Banelings themselves? He said Banelings are creatures of the flesh. When their souls return to this world, they need a body. What are you thinking? Burn them, Zed! place for you to keep up your end of our bargain. Hey! 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 Our thief won't be going anywhere without us. You brought him back without a scratch. How'd you manage that? I have other methods. What kind of methods? Well, however you did it. It's good work. Did you expect anything less? I'm just glad to have you on our side. Maybe you can tell Zed and Kaylin that they can stop sleeping with weapons under their pillows. The Taharan guards were killed on your watch. I gave you keys to the cells and a weapon. You wanted revenge for the death of your friends? I won't lie to you, Mother Confessor. After what they did to my friends, I'm not sorry they're dead. I'm just sorry I wasn't the one who did it. Which means there's still a killer out there. <laughs> Look, you can let me out. I'm not going to try to escape. I'll go with you to this Pomora. Is 
dead. It was the key to the Stone of Tears. I brought you back. You're welcome. I saw Dark and Raw. Dark and Raw. Who stabbed you? At first, I couldn't figure out how you got into a locked cell to kill the Daharans. But then I remembered. You're the daughter of a locksmith. You must have died before we arrived. I only accepted the Keeper's offer so that I could watch over William. This war has already made so many orphans. I couldn't bear the thought of my son being so alone and helpless. I had to keep killing to satisfy the Keeper. But after what the Daharans did to us, they deserved it. And when you ran out of Daharans, wouldn't you kill to protect the ones you love? You know, we can't let you kill any more people. Promise me. That you'll make sure my William is safe. find the easiest prey. That's the last of them. We'll need more. Then we'll head north. I have a more important task for you, General. My lord, you must capture the one who bears the rune of Pomora. Tell me where I can find him. He's in Tothrain. But, my lord, the Seeker is there. Then you don't have much time. The rune bearer is the key to finding the Stone of Tears. If the Seeker should acquire the stone, then the rift between the two worlds will be closed, and all of you returned to the underworld. I will not fail you. Kaelin is keeping everyone safe. You, Kara, and I are going to track the Banelings. And when we find them? We trap them and burn them. We're not going to need the horses. There's the room. Again! Put your backs into it, man! When Flynn was in the 
the underworld where all must have seen the room. You must know it's the key to the Stone of Tears. These walls are strong. If the Banglings can't get to us, they can't kill, and they'll die again. And just send his men to find more victims. They'll grow stronger out there while we grow weaker in here. They're not going to stop until they get in. Well, if they want in, we'll let them come. What about Kaylin and all the others? We'll get them out of the back way. This is a prison. There is no back way. You can make one. suffering these people have been through. Now they'll have a chance to rebuild their lives. Zed's already helping them with that. That's for you. Thank you. It's for your family. Thank you. You know, it's a long road to Pomora. Could get a little lonely. You're right. If you want to make it there in one piece, you won't try my patience. The Seeker said you needed me alive. <gasps> yes. But he didn't say you had to be comfortable. William, this is Bertrand. He's going to take you to a place called Timber Falls. There's a family there that can't wait to meet you. I think you'll like it there. Lots of children to play with. Does that sound all right? <laughs> Thank you. Goodbye. Desperate enough to accept the Keeper's offer. He's using their desire for life to create more death. Then can we risk killing our enemies? We don't have a choice. If we have to kill to save an innocent life, we'll do it. No matter how many souls a Keeper claims. As long as there are even a few people left to create life. And as long as people are willing to protect that life, the Keeper can't win. It's just over this next hill. You know, the other children can be so excited to see you. They, uh... You all right, William? Are you hurt? You're a bailing. 